Good evening. Opposition leader Mark Latham has promised more Australian support to help rebuild Iraq if Labor wins the next election. Mr Latham says Labor would commit $75 million to provide expertise and training to Iraqi authorities, as well as non-combat troops to support the United Nations mission in Iraq. Meanwhile, Kim Beasley will return to Labor's front bench as Shadow Defence Minister. The Australian cyclist at the centre of a new drug scandal has denied allegations he tried to import a banned drug five years ago. Sean Eady has rejected claims by Australian Customs that they seized a package mailed to him from the United States containing a banned growth hormone. Tomorrow's national weather, a few showers for Melbourne, morning showers in Adelaide and the chance of evening showers in Sydney. It'll be mainly fine in Hobart and fine in the other capital cities. Late lines along at 10.30. Good night.